How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. The expansions in Forza titles are always something we really look forward to, and there are many reasons to believe that we may be seeing information or news about the Forza Horizon 5 first expansion rather soon. And that's what we're discussing today. We're discussing the first expansion in general, what to expect and when to expect it, as we have a little bit of information. If you enjoy this video guys and it does help you out please do consider subscribing to the channel and leaving a like on the video so i know you've enjoyed it let's get into it what i want to talk about first is when we can expect this expansion to come out and when we can expect to hear and see information on what the first expansion is well there was something very interesting that i found on reddit i can't quite remember who posted it but it was about the previous expansions for the previous horizon games and something very interesting is the forza horizon 3 first expansion which was blizzard mountain came out 77 days after forza horizon 3 was released the first expansion for forza horizon 4 came out 76 days after forza horizon 4 was released so for forza horizon 3 and for forza horizon 4 the first expansion came out 76 days and 77 days after release sort of quite a quite an accurate average there now, what's very interesting is 77 days after Forza Horizon 5 released is next week, the 21st of January. Now, I don't expect the Horizon 5 expansion to release on the 21st of January next week. It's too soon. We've not heard anything about it. It just doesn't make sense. However, there's something else to do with the 21st of January, which makes everything seem a little bit more interesting. This is regarding a leak which popped up on the Reddit, and it is an Amazon listing for the Forza Horizon 5 Expansion 1. It's a listing where you can buy the digital code. Now, this listing is now apparently being deleted because there was actually a release date on this listing, and can you guess what the release date was? January 21st. Now, straight off the bat, this Amazon listing thing which appeared on the Forza Reddit could be fake. There are a few things about this listing which don't seem quite right to me. For example, there's no dollar sign on the $19.99 list price when there should be, and it says get $60 off instantly for doing this. How can you get $60 off a $18 product? Doesn't make sense. But if this listing is real, then could we expect something expansion related next week? Yes, we could. We could expect an announcement, some news. We could hear information about what the actual expansion is. It's not going to release next week because that's too soon. You know, we need to hype it up before that. Even if this Amazon listing is fake, which I personally think it probably is, not going to lie. As of next week, it would have been 77 days since the game was released, which is exactly how many days it was since the past Horizons released that we got the first expansion. While we're not getting the first expansion for this Horizon next week, I can guarantee that. We could certainly hear some information about it very, very soon because, as I said, it's about that time. Every single Horizon title has had their expansion released within the first three months, and we're getting quite tight on that. The 77 days thing is quite interesting and this Amazon listing leak certainly does back it up massively for the 21st of January. However, something just doesn't seem right. So I don't know about the Amazon listing, but regardless, it doesn't change that we should expect something rather soon. There's a very good possibility that the 21st of January was the original planned release date for the first expansion, but we all know that the game's had quite a lot of issues since launch, which may have delayed the process a little bit. I actually want to know what all of you guys think. What could the first expansion be? Obviously, I'm going to tell you what I think of it, but in the comment section below, have a guess. What kind of setting do you think it's going to be? Where do you think it's going to be? Um, how big? You know, what new features? What do you reckon? Just, just have a guess and see if you're right in the future. Now onto what the first expansion could be. Now we don't have any solid information on this, however we can make some pretty good guesses at what could be in it, and there is another leak as well. You may have seen when I was talking about the city expansion leak which turned out to be fake, as expected, I spoke that Nvidia, you all know of N Nvidia, they had a leak where they accidentally leaked the code names of the expansions for Forza Horizon 5. It is believed that the first expansion for Forza Horizon 5 is called Nightlights, that's just the code name, and the second expansion is called Upside Down, 
don't need to talk about the second expansion anytime soon that's miles away but yeah the first expansion apparently has a code name night lights now you can make your own guesses about what night lights could mean what it could be hinting towards if it's just a random code name but night lights when i hear the word night lights i think of a city i don't know why i think of a massive city litten up at night and that's what everyone's asking for everybody wants some kind of big city expansion and I'm going to tell you now why I think that that's certainly a possibility. Every single first expansion for a Horizon game has a new kind of feature within that expansion that they are testing for the next Horizon game. Forza Horizon 3 had Blizzard Mountain. That was their way of testing snow for Forza Horizon 4, the next Horizon game. Forza Horizon 4, in their first expansion, which was Fortune Island, had Trailblazers. That was their way of testing Trailblazers before Forza Horizon 5 released with Trailblazers. So it's a pretty good guess that there could be something within this first expansion that they are testing, something new, something quite big, that they are testing for the next Horizon game. Now the next Horizon game is miles away, there's no point even discussing it. However, everybody knows that everyone wants Japan as a location. Now people are expecting Japan as the next location because the next Forza Horizon game will make the most of the new consoles, it will be top tier. So if they are going to give us Japan for any Horizon game, it would be the next one. And the thing is with Japan, I would expect some big cities in Japan, big cities within the Japan map. Now could this add up with them giving us a bit of a city expansion for Forza Horizon 5, which is their way of testing a big city in a Horizon game ready for Horizon 6. Horizon 6, as I said, we shouldn't really be talking about that, but it just, just shows their process of testing things. Other than just guessing stuff like that and saying that the expansion one is going to have something different, something new to it, which they are testing for the next Horizon, and along with the code name we have, Nightlights, we could get a general idea of what it could be. The first expansion for every Horizon game is always quite realistic. We had Fortune Island, that was a, an island. Um, we had Blizzard Mountain, which again was a realistic thing. Expansion 2 is always a bit goofy, it's always a bit fun. Hot Wheels, Lego. So again, it's safe to presume that Expansion 1 for Horizon 5 will be realistic. It won't be a Fast and Furious one or a Lego uh, expansion. It'll be something realistic. And again, a city is certainly possible. There's no way of knowing without waiting and seeing. And with the information we have, we don't know when we're going to find out. However, from past experiences and from everything we're seeing and the odd thing that's been leaked, we could expect news on the first expansion soon-ish. I know seeing the release date on this Amazon listing of the 21st of January is very exciting, but I wouldn't believe it. I know it also adds up with being 77 days after Horizon 5 was released, which just ha happens to be when all the other expansions were released as well, 77 days after their release. Either that's a massive coincidence, or they did originally plan on releasing the expansion on the 21st, and it's been delayed. We have to remember that at the release of Horizon 4, the festival playlist wasn't even a thing. Can you imagine Forza Horizon 5 without the festival playlist? You know, no weekly challenges to do. It just seems very odd. So Forza has changed a lot since the last first expansion that we got, which was Fortune Island. So I think the first expansion for Forza Horizon 5 is going to be very good and a lot more fun than any of the other expansions we've had. I'm definitely very excited for the first expansion, regardless of what it's going to be. We'll find out eventually. Will it be soon? We'll have to wait and find out. But anyway, guys, just wanted to have a bit of a discussion about all of the talks going around on Reddit lately about when it's coming, if it's coming next week, what it could be, when to expect it. But for now, guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below and leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for more Horizon 5 content and I will see you all later.